Even when the weather is beautiful and the sun is shining, we still have to be prepared for flooding. Winter is officially here. And rain? We need more of it. But sometimes too much can lead to devastating consequences. With the state's historic drought extending into a sixth year, it's evident that we are in dire need of more rain. California, though, is susceptible to flooding, and even more so now after destructive wildfires left many areas in northern and southern California with dramatic burn-scarred hills. Because it could take many years for vegetation to become re-established, enough rain over an extended period creates elevated risks for flash flooding and debris flows. Most of these burn areas will be prone to this activity for at least two years. Thunderstorms that develop over the burned areas may begin to produce flash flooding and debris flows before a warning can be issued. While flash flooding and debris flows are extreme, there are also other concerns to be aware of once weather patterns change. Street flooding and gutter overflow can also create extensive problems. Make sure to keep gutters clean and clear of debris to avoid any excess water buildup. Find additional tips online at storms.ca.gov. And always remember to have a plan ready for yourself, your family, and your community. For more on how to prepare for flooding or other emergencies, visit oesnews.com. I'm Jonathan Goodell for Cal OES.